hi guys um, let's see in this video like how to create a sprint uh, and how to start a sprint and how to complete a sprint uh, so you you would all be aware like uh, what is a sprint a sprint is nothing but um, in a scrum framework like uh, how much task is going to get accomplished in a particular schedule like uh, i am there in the project list okay and i'm going to my company manage type software and i'm going to backlog okay so these are all my backlog items and still i have not assigned to any of the sprint okay and uh, uh, this is a product backlog like it has like 11 issues which includes bugs tasks and sorry so let me create a sprint here by going here okay so i'm just creating a sprint okay so now i'm uh, pushing this story to the sprint so automatically the story will get tagged in, the, in this one and it has one issue okay and let me push this bug also into this um, um, sprint so automatically you could see like uh, this is a bug and uh, and i'm tagging like if you want to push more than one story so just uh, click control and select uh, then you can push all together okay so now you have like uh, uh, five issues in this particular sprint okay so as you have pushed it to the sprint and you could see like whether this story is having assignment and if it is not assigned you could give an assignee name so already it is assigned and you can you can also estimate how much it is like five story points so already explained about estimation and uh, so now all the stories i mean uh, whatever uh, uh, stories or whatever bugs we are going to fix in a particular sprint we are keeping it in a sprint okay so next is that uh, let's uh, uh, see like uh, uh, so sprint has been started uh, so there are a few sprints uh, so just i'm going here you could see like there are four unassigned and uh, one is assigned okay and uh, if you want to change uh, uh, you can change the name of the sprint like uh, this is a sprint name okay and uh, you could change the sprint so now let's say like i'm starting it by today and like i'm changing it to two weeks okay and uh, if you make it as one week uh, it will automatically end date will be taken if you make it as two weeks automatically end date will be taken and you can even make a custom but mostly you know the companies will have one to four weeks of uh, schedule but mostly in lot of companies they follow two weeks sprint okay i'm just uh, updating it okay so now the uh, sprint is uh, updated so let me go here and i'm just moving the sprint up you can even move the sprint up okay uh, so it is here then again i'm moving it up if you want to move it up it's here then again i'm moving it right in the top okay so here there are no already i've created so there are no tasks you can even delete that sprints whatever it was created before since uh, those sprints are not used but mostly it will not happen like that i'm just showing it how to delete a sprint okay so now you could see like uh, the only one sprint is there so now you can go and start the sprint so as you start you could again they will it will go for this uh, dates again as i said now you can start it okay so now it shows a sprint board like where it is uh, in to do status and uh, you could move the story so in progress then you can move to done also okay but it not happen in one day uh, it will uh, take time to uh, the two weeks schedule this will get completed for, for the uh, sake i'm saying like how much uh, time it will take so now uh, all the stories are there in that uh, uh, sprint and it is in progress state so now if you want to complete the sprint you could complete it as you complete it says the one issue is done five issues are incomplete so you want to move those incomplete sprint to a new sprint so it will automatically get moved to a next available sprint okay so in this way like uh, you could uh, create you could start and you could complete the sprints and uh, so i go to and this is known as uh, and if you go to backlog here and this is known as the sprint whatever stories are there in the sprint 
it is known as um, sprint backlog okay guys uh, whatever stories you are taking in that particular sprint and whatever task and that will be termed as a sprint backlog 